our next variable will be a boolean so let's declare a boolean variable up here shall come here and say boolean boolean check we terminate this what we need to do is uh, when we click uh, when we click uh, our operator here then boolean check should go on boolean check is equal to true and then when we click a number here it should check first and see whether boolean is still on if a boolean check is equal to true is equal to true uh, then label one dot text uh, should equal to to null or to a blank uh, is that the way it's supposed to be Okay, so put or we execute this just in case a uh, boolean uh, check is uh, true. Let's look at this calculator again. Uh, when we click a 9 and then click a plus, boolean 1 will go on. So that when we click another 3, since boolean 1 is on, uh, uh, it will clear uh, text box one first uh, rather label one first and then go ahead and load it with this first executes this then it will load it with uh, the number uh, after that uh, yeah, after that we can turn off a boolean check should equal to false oh if I forget uh, you're seeing me sometimes using double sign and other times using a single equal sign when you are comparing this is for comparison so this first uh, sign means is and then the other one is equal so if this is equal to however if I use one single sign it means I'm assigning a value I'm making boolean check to become false that's why we have uh, such a sign now let's go ahead and test our calculator and see how it works so we test first of all we test the uh, the small point uh, 32 point maybe 5 6 again a point so we can't add another point plus uh, maybe 63 is equal to looks fine looks fine uh, what we need to do now is to uh, look at the other buttons as well so the only thing we need to do is to copy this I just copy this and then uh, put it down here and we make this an else if and make this one uh, a division make this a division as well uh, we need to collect all these operations uh, 
put them in their angle bracket like that do the same for this put it in angle bracket then uh, wrongly placed should place it somewhere here that should be fine so we are going to test for division and that should be it so uh, 8 divided by 4 is equal to 2 plus 8 is equal to 10 now all we need to do is uh, copy this and then copy this uh, come and paste it here and change this to multiplication multiplication here then uh, paste the same right there change this to minus and then minus there as well uh, we shall run it 9 divided by 6 is equal to should be able to give us the decimal points then times 10 is equal to uh, divide by 5 is equal to uh, minus 3 is equal to uh, times 99 is equal to 0 minus 3 is equal to negative so in our next uh, uh, video we'll be uh, dealing with these other buttons let me switch other buttons are remaining uh, the buttons up here then the button this side thanks for watching